Albinism is an inherited genetic condition that reduces the amount of melanin pigment formed in the skin, hair, and or eyes. It occurs in all racial and ethnic groups throughout the world. Persons with a congenital disorder often have problems with vision and are at risk of developing skin cancer. Globally, persons with a condition continue to suffer discrimination, neglect, and stigmatization, and Ghana is no exception. The educational facilities are not there for persons with albinism to stay in classroom. Um, when, when I was in school, for example, and some of the children that are coming, which I'm crying for, we are made to sit and study with people. We are made to sit and study from the same print of notebooks, exercise book. We are made to study from them. I would like the examination council to do something about the answer sheets. The font size of the objective test was it was very small and I struggled a lot. At a ceremony to mark International Albinism Awareness Day, instituted to prevent attacks and discrimination against persons with the condition, the Director of Education for Engage Now Africa, an NGO, Francis Ansa, indicated that the organization is engaging stakeholders in education to put mechanisms in place to ensure persons with albinism are allocated extra time during examinations. We are in uh, discussions with WAEC. We've laid a paper to them which they have accepted and which they'll be presenting on the day of their conference. And it will be accepted and um, people with persons with albinism across West Africa, for instance, will have the ability to have large fonts and extra time for their examinations. The Association of Persons with Albinism presented a petition to officials of the Commission on Human Rights and Administrative Justice charge on violations on their human rights in some four communities in the country and entreated the body to investigate their grievances. The theme for this year is Still Standing Strong.